Hello everybody, right now I'm so excited to do this vlog because right now I'm going to be doing a review to this Heidi Lauk's Spice Beef self eating Hot Pot. Yes, you heard it right, it's an instant self eating Hot Pot. I'm going to be honest with you, this is new to me because all of the instant food that I know, you at least need a microwave or a hot water, but not this one. All you need is a bottle of water and you just put it in and then it's going to be boiling and then heat it up all the ingredients inside. And it only takes 15 minutes to prepare before serving. So guys, come and join me to do my first self-healing hot pot. So stay tuned and stick around. Since 2017, self-heating hot pot meals have become a growing trend in China. These hot pot meals heat themselves due to a chemical reaction when the water is poured over the heater pad. The heater releases enough heat to warm up a pre-cooked meal 100 degrees in approximately 15 minutes. Hai Di Lao is the best-selling hot pot this time. It's a brand that became super famous in China since its launch 27 years ago. It's a hot pot restaurant with about 300 branches all across China and overseas and is especially known for its excellent service. All you need to prepare this hot pot is water, nothing more. This makes the self-heating hot pot popular among travelers, students, and office workers. You can basically have a warm meal wherever you are. The package contains various packages of ingredients, two bowls, chopsticks, a spoon, and one heating package. The ingredients in the packages contain real meat and vegetables, processed beef and strife, noodles, lotus root, potato, kelp, wood ear, bamboo shoots, and nami chill broth base. All ingredients need to be unpacked and put into the white bowl, which then needs to be filled with water up to the mark line within the bowl. The heating pack also needs to be unwrapped and placed inside the black bowl. Add some water to the black bowl up to the mark line. The heating pack will start to react right away. You'll need to place the white bowl inside the black bowl and put the cover on it so it will start boiling. Let the bowl work its magic for about 15 minutes, the steam will come from the cover. After this time, you can take up the cover and properly mix the ingredients. So good. The smell of the beef is so rich. So let's try it. So nice. It's so nice. Is it? And I don't think I can finish this all. I think this is good for two. I'm not sure. It depends how hungry you are. Let's try it first. Mm -hmm. Mm. It's not that super spicy. I, I really don't like the so spicy food. But I can call it this one. There's a taste of uh, Chinese herbs. This is good. I have no any idea what is this vegetable. But it tastes good. Very nice. I really like the taste of the I'm not sure if this is mushroom or what. Mm. Right now, I stir it at the bottom, and then all I see are your chilies. <laughs> And right now it's kind of spicy. 
No wonder why she's called the Spice Mirror. I really think Thai people would love this. Because I know how how spicy it can get. I really don't know what is this image, but it's really nice. Can somebody tell me what is this? Looks like it has a hose on it. Really nice. I like the mixture of the noodles, the vegetables, and the beef. Ah, love it. It's nice. It's hot. Really nice. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the vlog right now. And I hope I can share this with you. <laughs> Really nice, really, really nice. Actually, guys, if, to all my friends that's living here in Thailand, if you want to make it a business, just send me a direct message. I'm gonna let you know the information. If you want to sell it or if you want to try it, if you want to buy it, just let me know. Just send me a message, okay? Once again, my name is Nito Bai, and I love this Heidi Lau spicy beef. Self heating hot pot. Yeah, this is my very first time to try it, and absolutely I'm glad trying it. Okay. Until next time.